What you guys gonna have a product review here sent over by Rytech.com. This is the Rite Ultra Slim K12 plus 2.4 gigahertz mini wireless keyboard with touchpad. Uh, this is uh, great for all your uh, devices that you want to use it on. Inside the box, you're gonna get your keyboard, uh, your user manual, thank you card, and a cable. Now this cable will be your charging cable, USB, cable and a pass-through cable all in one so you can use the actual device and charge it at the same time okay now you can also get your user manual and this will tell you uh, what your uh, device is uh, compatible with and it's compatible with Windows, Linux, Smart TV, Android, Raspberry Pi, XBMC, Kodi and all your TV boxes there that you may want to use it for so it's awesome for that type of stuff and uh, it works up to 10 meters uh, away from the actual device which is really nice. You've got your LED uh, counter, uh, indicator here and also it will tell you all your information that you may need about this keyboard. Now only buy the Riotech ones because these are the actual uh, original ones. There's loads of copies out there but the Riotech have been making these for a long time and they're some of the best ones out there on the market. So this is the actual keyboard itself. It's a mini QWERTY keyboard as you can see here. It's got all your function keys uh, up the top which is really nice. Uh, as you can see, very uh, responsive uh, keyboard and touchpad on this little device. It's seven inches long, believe it or not. And I don't like getting the real small ones because they do hurt my hands. But this one is just a nice size. And you can see the function keys up here with loads of little uh, uh, functionality to them. And you can uh, read up all about those. As I said, this does have a mouse built into it, a mouse pad, as you can see on the right hand side. You've got your cursor keys here for moving up and down if you wish to do that. Um, but also, as I said, the mouse left click, right click, and also the mouse pad is all built in here. And it's super uh, responsive too. And it's great for all those uh, XBMC or Kodi or, or TV boxes, Linux, anything you want to use it for, it's great for that. So if you've got a Raspberry Pi, this is right up your street. It really is. Let's take a look on the back of the device. You can see it does have a milliamp uh, battery in it, uh, which is a 300 milliamp uh, battery, uh, which is uh, lithium as well and you've got these little rubber feet which stop it slipping and you've got that brushed aluminum look or aluminium if you live in the UK and you've got your little anti-slip uh, stoppers here with a little raised area so it just gives you a nice typing uh, angle now also on there you have a little slidey area which you can slide out which will have your USB dongle in there uh, this is so you can actually plug it into the end of the cable we'll take a look at that in a second but that's hidden away inside that little compartment there. So you can either plug this straight into a device or you can plug it into the cable, which I'd advise you to do because it allows you to then charge your keyboard whilst using it if you want to be uh, close to that device. You do have a power on uh, switch here and you have your charging uh, port here as well. Now also again, this will switch itself off after about three minutes, it's got an automatic shutdown on this so if you don't use it for three minutes it will uh, shut down to save the battery life and the battery life lasts ages on this keyboard so you don't have to keep recharging it as I said I'll just put my hand up here and you can see how small it is it's not too small where it's uncomfortable it's just the right type of size now also uh, let me take a look at the actual device here we've got a, a Android TV box which it works well with you've got your dongle which comes with it and you plug it into the cable that's how I would use it plug that into the um, USB port here and then plug that into your device which you want to uh, use and the beauty of it is if you're really close uh, you can actually plug the charging port in uh, while you're using the device and it will charge it so if you plug this into the charging port now you can still use the actual device whilst it's charging it gives you a reasonably long cable too so that's pretty decent so again, uh, if you are looking for this type of uh, keyboard, then uh, look no further than the Rai uh, K12 Plus. Also, the device comes with uh, scissor switch keys, and if you are interested in it, the price for US is $37.99 plus 20% discount on that price, and $19.99 in the UK plus 20% off of that price. These are other two that are, are pretty popular, which you don't get no discount on, uh, so, um, I mean, you can see the, the quality of their products. They've got loads of keyboards and, and uh, remotes, as you can see here, which are pretty decent. Uh, so don't buy any uh, copies 
of these devices the right tech.com ones are the originals and they're the ones that you want to purchase okay guys there's loads of other uh, patterned copies out there which aren't the same as these and the build quality isn't the same okay and you will run into problems so stick with what's been around for a long time anyway i'm going to wrap this one up i want to thank uh, Rytech for sending this one over to me for a review my name is brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk I hope you enjoyed it guys, if you do like it then hit the like button and I'll see you again in the next video, bye for now.